Hey guys, it is Arika Misha. It's Saturday morning breakfast. So let's get into what I'll be cooking today. Uh, this is what I have. I have some Publix Bakery Biscuits. They are my new addiction. They are delicious. All right, and I have the Smithfield Thick Cut Bacon because y'all know won't do nothing skinny over here. Gotta have a thick cut bacon. All right, and we got some Publix Large Eggs. Grade A eggs. Okay, Publix. All right, and we got some Kraft Mozzarella Cheese. The mozzarella cheese. I will show you guys what I'm going to be cooking. I'm trying to come up with a name for them. I just thought of this. I'm always thinking of something different to cook for the girls. You know, just to keep them interested in breakfast. Uh, but I love cooking breakfast on Saturday morning for the family. I've got these Publix biscuits. Um, not really sure what I'm going to call them. I'm thinking right now, biscuit breakfast poppers? I don't know, y'all. I'll make up something. Y'all sing the title. So, let's get into this breakfast. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, I went ahead, cooked the bacon and the eggs. Didn't think you guys needed to see that. I did cook the bacon, and I chopped it up real fine. And I scrambled the eggs, and I chopped them up real fine as well. We've got our cheese. I just wanted the main focus of the video uh, to be on making uh, the biscuit. Alright. Okay, so let's go. Now I've got a pan here with parchment paper. So my biscuits don't stick. Let's get our biscuits put down. And my goal is to squeeze all the biscuits on this one pan. That's my goal. Let me see. It's gonna be like a puzzle here. But we're going to get them all on this one pan. To squeeze them on here. But we're going to get them on here. All right, and make sure you guys can still see. Okay, yes. All right. I want you guys to see what I'm doing here. I got two more biscuits I need to squeeze on here. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, yep. Let's get them across in threes. My pan is a little bit small, but oh, we're gonna squeeze them on here. Squeeze our biscuits. I'm really trying to squeeze these biscuits. puzzle here trying to squeeze them okay that's gonna have to be good enough okay good enough good enough all right because you guys will see why okay Phew. got all my biscuits stuck down there now remember our biscuits are already cooked they're already cooked biscuits we ain't got to do much with those so I'm gonna put some butter you guys know I love the I can't believe it's not butter I love this butter sometimes I switch up just depends on what's on sale so, we're going to put some butter across the top. Oh, yeah. Got to put the butter on the biscuits. Okay. Now, I want to... I do want to spread the butter. I don't want it, want it to be chunky. So, we're going to spread the butter. Make sure our biscuits get a nice amount of butter. Because we know that butter is going to melt into our biscuits. So that our biscuits are nice and have that buttery flavor. Oh, don't that sound so good? Buttery flavor. Mm. Okay. Make sure y'all still see. Okay, good, good, good. Because sometimes my camera be acting crazy like it wants to move all around. Alright, so let's get all the butterliciousness on the biscuits. Get that spread it out. Okay. <clears throat> Smells so good. I love these biscuits. I picked them up one day from Publix 
you know, because I didn't feel like, you know, doing the whole frozen biscuits. And I grabbed these one day. I was like, oh, these look inter interesting. I can do this quick and easy. And show sure enough, ever since I've been getting these biscuits, the day I got them, I've been addicted to them. They taste so good. Publix did all the work for me. All I'm going to do is just heat it up. Just heat them up. They're already cooked and everything. And you know what? They do have that uh, country style. Uh, they already have like a little butter flavor to them already. But I'm just adding more butter. Just a little bit more butter here, Publix. But yeah. Almost finished with the butter. Do my last one over here. I'm telling you, these things barely made it on here. I was squeezing them. Like playing a game of who's that Tetris? All right. Well, you need a little bit more butter over there. Okay. All right. So look, we got them all buttered up. Close my butter. Okay. So we got them all nice and buttered up. Okay, you guys can see real good. Okay. Now the first thing I'm gonna do, I wanna put my cheese down first. The reason why I'm putting the cheese down is so that my bacon and my eggs can stick to the biscuit. And this is just something I made up. I mean, I'm always trying to come up with, you know, new ideas for the kids and the channel, of course, you know. And don't forget, guys, to go over to my uh, second channel. It, the link will be in the description box, my second channel. That's my spiritual journey channel. Definitely go over there and subscribe. Show me some love and support over there as well. I'm telling you, these two channels, they are a lot of work. But you know, nothing great comes easy. All right, so see, I've got the cheese down. Make sure you guys can see. Uh, I don't want to zoom you guys in too much because I want you guys to get the full picture. Okay, so we got the cheese down. Let's go ahead. Gonna drop some eggs. Dropping the eggs on the biscuits. Got to kind of smash it down, you know, because the cheese isn't melted yet. So, smash it down. Smash the eggs into your cheese. I'm telling you guys, this is going to be good. Delicious. And then you know what? I'm going to add some more cheese after I add the bacon. So that, you know, that cheese is going to help everything stick together. Doesn't that look delicious? That looks so good. Gotta make sure our eggs don't roll off over here on the side. biscuit casserole kind of what it looks like to me but I'm telling you once that butter melts into those biscuits that cheese melts oh my goodness I'm telling you my mind is always thinking my mind is always thinking look at that goodness now y'all know that looks good let me wash my hands real quick Okay, get my hands washed and dried. Tell me that don't look delicious. Oh, we got some escape egg over there. Oh no, all we cooking all our groceries. Look at it. Now wait until I put the bacon on. Oh, y'all can't tell me that don't look good. I'm still trying to come up with a name for this. It's like biscuits with breakfast on top. Like the breakfast is on top of the biscuit. Like I don't want to call them biscuit sliders because that's not what they are. Because the breakfast is not inside the biscuit. Um, I don't know. Well, you guys will see the title by now so you'll already know what name I came up with. It's like I want to call it because it's breakfast on top of the biscuit. Yeah, I don't know how that sounds. Breakfast on top of biscuits. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to come up with. Um, 
Huh, I don't know. And I'm going to put this in the oven. Before I forget to say, I've got my oven preheated at 350 degrees. Um, I'm going to put this in the oven for about, actually about 15 minutes. Give the biscuits time to get that butter melted, cheese and everything all melted. Um, yeah. Before I forget, I'm going to put it in the oven, 350 degrees for about 15 minutes. About 15 minutes, give everything time to melt, come together. Let's make sure I got enough bacon on all the biscuits now. Enough bacon everywhere. Let's share it. Kind of pat it down, you know, so everything kind of sticks together. Pat it down, you know. Oh my goodness. Y'all can't tell me that don't look good. Oh my God. Okay, now I'm going to put a little bit of cheese across the top. Just a little bit of cheese. You know what? I want to do a short. Hold on, y'all. Y'all want to see it firsthand. Y'all get a little behind the scene action. A little behind the scene. You guys will see me doing my short. Let me go ahead get my video ready on my phone and you guys get a little behind the scene action all right video i'm getting ready to record hold on guys hey guys it's arika misha in the kitchen doing what i do cooking it up it's that saturday morning breakfast and this morning we're in the kitchen cooking it up for the family haven't quite came up with a name for these yet but it's breakfast on top of a biscuit breakfast biscuits I don't know you are this is Arika Misha come over to my channel see what name I came up with I don't know you are but y'all got that behind the scene action let me take a quick picture oh goodness yeah that's a good picture I always like to get a real close in zoomed in picture people love that oh look at that shot that's the money shot all right, y'all, so let's go ahead and get, let's get our last layer of cheese on so the cheese can help everything melt together. We just want to put a little bit. We don't want to do too much. Just a little bit of cheese, you know, to help the bacon and the eggs all stick together. We don't want to do too much. Just enough to help everything stick together. Got to be careful on the sides here. Oh, that looks amazing. Okay, I'm getting happy with the cheese. Okay, calm down, girl. Calm down. All right, y'all. That's it. That's all. Y'all see it. So, I'm going to go ahead and put in the oven 350 degrees for about 15 minutes so everything can melt together all nicely. Y'all, I'm ready to eat right now. I'm ready. I'm ready. So, let me get these in the oven and I'll be back with that grand finale. All right, guys, I just took them out of the oven, 350 degrees for 15 minutes. And they look amazing. They look delicious. Take y'all in real quick. Oh, yeah, y'all can see how that cheese melted. I didn't want to brown it, you know, too hard across the top. All right. Well, y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media uh, at Arika Misha. That's Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, of course. Thanks, guys. Bye.